Hey everyone, it's Raphael here from XX Raphael Productions and I'm going to be showing you how to convert RPM packages into Debian packages, okay? So, first of all, open your terminal and um, basically what RPM stands for, it is Red Hat Package Manager. So, if you're on a Debian-based distribution like Ubuntu or Mint, this video will help you out. So, let's go ahead and show you the package that I'm going to install and that is a ZenMap package, the installer. I got it from this website over here, which is basically the graphical user interface of Nmap, network scanning tool. So let's go ahead and use this as an example for the video, okay? So these are the commands I will be using in order to make this work. So this will be in the description below, okay? Um, I'm going to go ahead and copy that, but before we actually install it, I'm going to go to root, so do sudo su, enter in your password, and we're going to copy and paste that command. But Let's go ahead and do that right now. All right. There we go. And it should install without any problems. Now, obviously, I've already installed mine. As you can see, it's just a newest version. But if it's not installed yet on your computer, go ahead and make sure it installs. All right. So do alien and then the package name, which is ZenMap. Um, I don't want to type it all out, so I just did tab to autocomplete. And that should work. So. Depending on how big your package is, it might take a, a bit longer, but here we go. So now mine has been generated. And if I go ahead and do ls again, I now have the, the Debian version. So now I can install it with dpackage. So dpackage-i, dpkg, and then the name of the Debian um, package, which is going to be um, auto-completed with tab, and then go ahead and click enter. Now you can clearly see that um, it is installing and it should complete without any errors. Now let's go ahead into ZenMap and see how it's like. And that you can see I have the graphical user interface of Nmap and it is working perfectly fine. So that is very easy. Now this can work for any other package. I've only used this as an example, but it should work for other RPM packages as well. If, so hopefully this video helped you out. And if you have any other questions, Feel free to ask them down in the comments, but the video description should be enough.